What's up guys, my name is Michael and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to go over another lead code challenge of kth smallest element in a sorted matrix. So you're given an n by n matrix where each of the row and column are sorted in ascending order and find the kth smallest element in the matrix. So uh, it's exactly the same thing as kth smallest element in a array. In o the only difference is that it's now a matrix. Okay, so we could use a min heap and then keep store all the values of the matrix into that min heap and then iterate from the beginning to get the kth, uh, kth smallest element but that would take uh, o of log of n squared yeah o of log of n squared which would take uh, which is takes a lot of space so what we're going to do is we're going to use a max heap and we're going to go through every element in the matrix and then we will compare the each element, if it's less than the value in the max heap, will remove the value of the max, the top value of the max heap, and then at the at the end, the to, uh, the first value of our max heap is going to be the smallest element in the matrix, the kth smallest element in the matrix. And uh, if you don't understand what I'm talking about, you could watch the, some other videos that I made about how to do this. But yeah, okay, so we're gonna go go through every value in the matrix and then what we're going to do is we're going to create a max heap so priority queues are already max heaps based on the in C++. If you want to make it a min heap, you have to change this to a greater, add a comparator in your priority queue, but normally it's already max heap. So, Okay, if our max heap size is less than k, we are going to add just the value of the at, we are going to add the current value we're at in the matrix. Otherwise, we are going to check Check if the current value we're going to add is less than the top value of our max heap. And if that's the case, we're going to remove the top value of our max heap. And then we're going to push it, add it also. So by the end, we're going to have all the kth smallest elements in our, uh, in our, pretty much in our array. Okay, and then at the end of this, we're gonna return turn max heap dot top. Submit, and it got accepted. So yeah, that's how you would do this problem. Uh, it's pretty basic. Break, comment, subscribe. I'll check you guys later.